Hi, this is uh, Jody Wistanoff from Way Out West and you're in my studio here. Um, I'm just going to give you a little guided tour, show you the stuff that we use and um, some of the equipment that I use when I put together Loopmasters sample CDs. So over in this corner we've got like <clears throat> a few like, old drum machines here, like the classic 808 with this classic little electro noise there, little 909 for that. That's like, you know, the original house music drum machine, you know, so nice to have a few of these old pieces lying around. A little bit of a 101. Bit of, bit of that. <laughs> um, a few other kind of old keyboards right here. This um, monster right here has given me hours of entertainment. Kind of like, here we go. Love a bit of that. It's, you know, hours of fun. Get the Mad Scientist vibe going on, you know. A mixing desk, which is something that you probably won't see in many um, digital studios these days. Um, it's actually a large patch bay. Unfortunately, I'm just kind of like using it to take all the, um, the inputs from the keyboards that surround me here before they go into the computer for mixing. So it's not actually used for mixing, it's just a convenient thing. Do you know what I mean? But over here we have um, the heart of the operation. I'm actually writing in Ableton live over here, which is um, an incredible piece of software for um, many things. But when it comes to finishing the tracks off, I put it into Pro Tools over here, which is like the high-end, um, you know, audio editing thing, and you know, it's just kind of like the plugins are second to none. So it's a nice working combination, you know. Um, this is the, the Jupiter 8 down here that I used extensively on the Loop Masters sample pack. I think I used this sound quite a few times to have a look. Just real nice, kind of, you know, sharp attack, percussive kind of sorty kind of sound. In my opinion, Ableton. Live is possibly one of the finest inventions since the wheel. <laughs> Recently, I think it's you know it's really kind of um, revolutionised making music and just opened it out to kind of like a lot of um, people that are starting up. There's a way that you can just you know get in a flow and just enjoy it. You know, there's like the learning curve is a lot less steep than say you know how you, when we started ten years ago. You know, you'd have to like have samplers, you know, an Atari, a mixing desk, blah 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 blah. There's you know a lot more. That went into it with Ableton, you can literally just get going, bring loops in, drag things in, pitch them up and down as you would with a sampler, which is something that you can't do in any other door. You know, it's like you know, it's a unique feature which really appeals to to um, people like us that come from a sampling background, um, which is you know, it's a wonderful thing. You know, so I'll give you a little demo of what I mean. You can literally just open up things. So here's I've got the um, Loop Master sample pack that I did right here, so I can go into a little baseline thing, drag it out, plonk it down, place. And it's amazing, it just if as long as the, the loops are like cut to the bar, which they are with the sample packs and all these kind of things, you can literally just bring it out, plonk it down and away you go, you know, so got something in the key of E right here, you can go to like go for like a riff or something. Uh, the riffs, something in E. Drag that out, put it there. Oh, wait a minute. Do you know what I mean? And it's just bang, it's right, ready to go. And then you can just get like a little drum beat or something. Put that down there. You're having fun right away, do you know what I mean? This is like seconds and you're in there. And this is just, um, you know, you can go as, as far as you want. You can chop things up, you can change the key of things. You can like, if you double click on a, say the riff here, you can pitch it down by a third. There's no other program that allows you to do that. Pro Tools doesn't allow that, Logic doesn't do that. Ableton is dope, I'm loving it.